No contest. Test. Oh, there we Jesus. go. All right, we got some fire. <laughs> Good evening, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to the Smash Chateau, hosted today by Underground Gaming. Shoutouts to them for hosting us. Uh, we've got not as many people as usual, but you know we're in Omaha, not Lincoln tonight. Um, we've got some exciting matches for you. We've got some people coming on commentary uh, shortly. No house with the haircut, haircut game swag. Uh, so yeah. Um, we're going to go ahead and get started really soon. Um, I don't know what matches we have. Michael will call them out. I'm going to hop off. I'm going to do production stuff. I might come on and like swag and hype up a match or two. You know, you never know. We're going to have a lot of commentators tonight. We're going to have a lot of fun. I hope you guys enjoy the stream. Good this time. is the first ever 480p stream like you will see like in Smash. Like this is, <laughs> this is the apex. Of Smash Stream, that is so loud. <laughs> Wait, no, but like to the stream. Who is Shifty? Shifty uh, comes to Lincoln a lot. Oh, man, I'll, I'll show you. Him. Shifty's my boy. Oh, we're dropping frames. That's not good. Mm. Yep. Okay. So <laughs> dropping frames. Click game All and right. players. The second from the top on the left. Second from the top on the left on the right. Right. Right window. I got it. I'm gonna switch over there in a second. You wanna commentate? There we go. Look at that buttery crisp 480p. Mm. Isn't that delicious? It's tasty. That's the, so good. All right. So Wait, I'm gonna at, hop off. Look at on. those hands jiggle. Look at the jiggle hands. What's up with the? Hey, I'll be here as long as I am before I'm playing. And I'll give this a go. Yeah. And we're back. All right. So I'm sure you've had it mentioned before, but our, uh, our video is crispy and crispy. It is 480p. And, uh, to my knowledge, it's going to be well a lot higher than a lot of streams. So yeah, we got the eSports right. setups going on now. Got our nice, like, PC monitor CRT over here. Looking pretty good. Zero lag, heavy as balls. Getting ready to play. Right, Someone needs to adjust the player cam. Yeah. Player cam needs to go a little more. And we're off. Right. A little bit more. Yeah, that'll be good for now. This is our uh, first game. We're still kind of getting adjusted. We're in a new place. I had to switch focus to switch the stream layout. <laughs> Should move the camera though, just a little bit. No, our camera's fine. It's the player well, cam that's. Well, I'm like, it's a little better now. Yeah. Can I represent Huddle? That was an exciting hand one. And we're playing the waiting game. Currently winning. Da -na 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 -na. Alright. Here it goes. Is this the real deal? Alright. Still not the real deal. Yeah, we had the uh, the webcam above the TV earlier. I don't know why. It's I think it was a little too close, so that's why they moved it back. No. Well, here we can see half their faces. We can assemble them into a two face. If they could just sit a little bit closer to each other. There we go. Yeah, we're all friends, yeah, there we right? Go. That's get close, perfect. get friendly, you know. It's a loud joystick. I always like how loud this game is, you know. 
It's it's the triggers, man. It's not as loud as like you know, Street Fighter. It's real. All right, so we got Kumi versus I, I think this is real now. This matchup, I enjoy this matchup a lot. Uh, back a few days of playing, well, a lot of days playing Marth. Uh, it's nice that you don't, you don't see a whole lot of Sheik at all. Yeah, not around here especially. We have very few people who have a well-oiled Sheik. Uh, the, the interesting thing about this matchup, uh, especially for Marth, but for most characters, is that it's actually beneficial for both to stay grounded. So you'll see a lot of grab approaches, a lot of uh, wave dash down tilts from Marth. Um, because both characters, and you'll see here, once they get the other into the air, they're just free. Yeah, they're both relatively, well, not fast fallers, but they're not floaty at all. He's not Sheik in this state. Yeah, Sheik's not terribly floaty. Marth's a bit floatier. Uh, so he uh, maybe has a bit worse time in the air, but both just kind of... Uh, He's a bit of a wider target. Well. Yeah. They both just get juggled around really badly. So you'll see both, you know, throwing dash attacks. You'll see both going for the uh, jump cancel grabs. Yeah, there's a lot of zoning games going on here. Yeah, very much so. Now, Sheik on the ledge is a, a very scary thing uh, for a couple reasons. A, because there are options coming off the ledge are yeah. super good. Uh, a little hard to protect compared to a lot of other uh, characters. And it also means you can't take the ledge from her, which is probably the best way to edge guard a Sheik. Yeah, there's a whole lot of Sheik can do. All right, charge up. death smash. Here we go. Forward throw F smash there. If uh, Sheik hadn't DI'd outwards, then that's a that's a pretty solid swing. Most players will, will DI that forward throw outwards though. I hope she can uh, carry this life out. It's, uh, not great to die at the same time. Yeah. Okay, so that wasn't a very safe up air from me uh, tank. Hoping for uh, to capitalize a little more on these grabs here. He's getting, uh, you know, maybe one or two hits off each grab. Uh, whereas in this matchup, you really want to convert each grab to a death if you can. That's an unfortunate miss wave dash. Yep. Here we go. <laughs> 69. Yeah, he's got the factor. 69 factor. X factor. Well, no changes, I suppose. <laughs> How do you pop a nooch like that? It's insane. It's <laughs> a good word. <laughs> I'm not, not sure what it means. It sounds I, funny. Yeah. Uh, Found a pretty so interesting go, choice. Yeah, going what to lot more interesting dreams. platform game going on here. Yeah, this is this is a stage that's very much uh, in Sheik's favor, generally speaking. Uh, well, there's a lot of weird jazz you can do with the platformers when they're kind of half height. Yeah. That yeah. That said, Marth can get some pretty uh, giant combos off these platforms as well. I think the uh, sides offer a little bit uh, more friendly recovery, though, don't they? Yeah, it depends. Uh, it's certainly not your. Uh, you know, your battlefield or your like Pokemon Stadium where Marth can get stuck under the edge. I don't think it benefits these characters quite as much as a few others though. No. Both of these characters have a pretty you know, fair time. I think a fox would be a lot happier here. Sure. For, for the recovery at the very least. Okay, good job on uh you tank capitalizing on that messed up bait. That skewer is really rude. 
One of, one, definitely one of Marth's best moves, and certainly in this matchup, one of his best moves. Uh, that down tilt. Oh, wonderful Ken combo. Good edge guard. Right, it's Sheik here just holding the ledge. Pretty solid. Very smart. Seems like with this uh, Sheik here, once, once you're in the air at the edge, she seems to be very good at taking control here. Yes. Just basically owning the lane. Now the uh, Marth Fairy is, is in most cases safe on the shield if you sweet spot it. Uh, what he did there is pulled a little too close to Sheik, which allowed her to get the grab uh, out of shield. Really would like to see Marth uh, trying to take the ledge a little more. It would help him a lot in terms of uh, not allowing Sheik to come back. Seems like uh, Marth is being a little more conservative with the uh, guarding. Yeah, before. which you really can't afford to be in this matchup. You gotta be, you gotta be ready to get on that ledge. Oh, here we go. Oh, see, yeah, I see what I'm talking about. Good down smash. Ah, uh, solid guard. There you go, gotta respect the frames. You tank getting a little greedy there with the F throw F smash, just hoping to get a quick kill to even the game up. It's very similar than to the last match. Two to one, similar damage. Well, and a lot of times you'll get in that situation too. You're down to stocks. So you want to even things up a little bit to Ooh, make it. Uh, some interesting counter kind of dreams grab action going on. This is one thing I've always thought was really weird. The game doesn't really seem very prepared to handle grabs at different heights. So yeah, just kind of certainly a lot. A lot of the glitches we'll see, especially on uh, mm -hmm. stages like Fountain, stages like uh, Pokey, uh, yeah. and especially Yoshi's Story. Uh, there are some weird glitches based on yeah. uh, grabbing on moving platforms. Mm -hmm. uh, in fact, on Yoshi, Yoshi's story, if you grab a character on Randall uh, and forward throw them into the stage, they can actually go inside oh. the stage. That's interesting. Yeah. Can I get JDM versus Combi on stream? All right. What do we got going on on chat here? Yep. Good observation. DDR sensation. That indeed was mutant. LMAO bot uh, is terrible. Thank you, Noah. I miss Please you. understand. Where are you? The bot is wonderful. <laughs> I did not know our bot said that. Yeah, it welcomes everyone in chat. This bot is Ugu. Our faces are pretty blue. I want to see if I can make that not the case. I think it's probably just the. I think the, it's the backlight from the, the shirts. Uh, shirts, too, yeah. It brings out the blue in our faces. <laughs> you can't see it with your eyes normally, but cameras can see more than we can, you know. That's a little better. All right, ooh, ice climbers. Psych, not ice climbers. Yeah, no, we got some really small pools tonight. I think it's nine and ten. I think location definitely hurts us a lot. We're also missing a few regulars we normally have. So, yeah, uh, lots of uh, huddle folks. But well, we're glad to be here to be able to test out the stream in this location, for, especially for tomorrow. It's going to be pretty hype tomorrow. Yeah, the folks at Underground have been... Absolutely great. This venue is really yeah, nice. This is great. Uh, you know, we, we have a lot of more control over just how things are laid out here than I guess we're probably used to. So certainly, <laughs> certainly much more space than, than Noah and B's living room. <laughs> yeah. As much as I love it. Yeah. As much as we've tried to optimize it, I think there are definitely some limits there. All right, I put my money on Final Destination. <laughs> Yo, Cam, is there any it's way to turn off uh, autofocus on this webcam? Yeah, it just kind of does what it wants. I can freak it out, like, right. now it's going to be all out of focus. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Who knows? Ah, oh, well. Called it. Totally called it. FD. I don't even know why I'm out there. We should just do FD all these. It's all about Battlefield, man. Battlefield. I'm the, over an FD fan. The forever neutral stage. FD definitely favors the new characters over some others. 
after looking at the uh, at the real stream TV and then seeing the other like regular piss composite machines we have, it's just like it doesn't even stack up. Hope I can only play on that. Thanks, TV. Derek. Cam also says thanks. <laughs> Are there friendly setups here? Yeah, we got quite a few setups that aren't being used, especially because of the uh, yeah the low number of entries. It's not supposed to be got dedicated friendly, it's just they're not always in use because of lockup. So I mean, it's inevitable people will play friendly. Well, here. and we're only I think we're only running like two games at once to kind of drag uh -huh. this out a little bit. So plenty of TVs here to play friendlies on. Is this warmers or is this real? Uh, it, this looks real. So we got JVM playing Mark against Kumbi Uh JVM is going to be. I would say probably a bit more experienced in the matchup than what we just watched. Uh, JVM has been around the block, I would say. Just a bit, yeah. I think we've definitely heard of him before. See, that? there's that follow I'm hype about taking. Emo Dinosaur pleasure. Roar, here we go. Follow hype! Emo Dinosaur Roar. Roar. Thank you. That was a very follow. coordinated effort from the two of us. <laughs> yeah, we tried. We're new. C minus. Yeah, it's all, right. all caps again. Like, ah. This is uh, reminding me a little bit of the last game, but uh, basically with a more aggressive, more, yeah. a little more edge action. Oh, There's there we that go. Ken combo. Nice uh, recovery there from Sheik. It might be too little too late. Ooh. Oh, yeah, see, that's the end around. There we go. Uh, FD Connors wants to help you out. A lot of weird stuff you can do with the angles in FD. Yeah, a lot of characters can kind of ride the wall to get an extra distance on their recoveries. Some weird stuff that YouTube can do. <laughs> kind of just going, you know, through the platform. Like he owns the place. It's like the last match, you just swap personalities. <laughs> so yeah, you'll see a lot of tilts from Sheik to kind of try and extend these combos out of the grabs. Sheik's tilts are amazing. I think the nice magic number is going to be two. Ooh. That was an unfortunate air dodge. He tried it. It looks like he tried to OMS attack, uh, where you just immediately attack out of the hit, the IN down into the ground. Uh, but it ended up being an air dodge. Nice fake out with the empty short hop. Sheik's F smash, probably her worst move, not safe on the shield at all. Uh, oh! I love it going for the. Uh, Charge death smash out of the roll. That's how you really just tell an opponent that you're in control is when you do things like that. Tell them I'm uh, in your head. I really like the characters have moves that move them quickly, like the, uh, especially the recovery, and it's just completely countered perfectly by the time. The denial. some sort of book club because he read him like a book. There we, there we go. go, the tipper. Alright. D Dodger Sensation says wall hugging doesn't actually improve distance, uh, recovery distance wise. I actually didn't know that. It certainly uh, seems well, like it does, looks but like thanks I'm for up, the info. So, uh, see you. Hey JBM. Noah wants to know why you're being a sandbagging bug. Noah wants to know why you're being a sandbagging bug. And we're back. Apparently not. Not time to go yet. Oh, Noah, JBM says the TV feels strange. Yeah, well, he's wrong. You know what we say to that, Moffat? Huh? You know what we say to that? Oh. No Johns. Do you have anyone named John here? That'd be nice. <laughs> well, number one, Get it's out. not TV. Get out. So I have headphones on and people are pointing and talking and I have no idea what they're saying. It's fascinating. <laughs> oh yeah. Oh, we got more pointing and uh, now he's pointing at someone else. And he's pointing at a lot of people okay. right now. Here, I will get out and I will play. Who am I? I don't know if this pointing concerns me, but uh, it sure is exciting. We've got another match. Let's see what I can do with this. Well, right. Well, Marth is hitting Sheik, and it's bad for Sheik. And uh, now Sheik has hit Marth back, but I think Marth plans on hitting Sheik once more. Oh, 
And Mars continues to hit Sheik, and Sheik is not really hitting a whole lot. Oh, Sheik finally hit back. That's good. Well, Mars knows the strategy, though. The strategy yeah. tends to be hit the opponent, that's but a don't get hit yourself. That's a classic edge guard right there. He's pretty much getting most of his kills with that. You know, JBM was just mentioning that he thinks there's a little bit of lag on this team. But I haven't mm. heard anybody else say so. Well, if you give me a whiteboard, I'll explain for two hours why that's not the case. In electrical engineering, let's go. Uh, when I played on it earlier, I didn't, I didn't feel any lag. Yeah, so. it's pretty much physically impossible for that one in particular to lag. Amazing, I see us commenting on the, uh, the latency of the previous TV we tried to use. Um, that one we had confirmed at least one frame of lag, so it's not really the case. But uh, I don't know if it's worth explaining. I mean, it depends. It's uh, well, I, I mean, yeah, I'd have to play on a score to, to get an idea, but I, I thought it felt fine. I, it might just be the way it. I mean, it doesn't, it doesn't not have any uh, picture processor in it, it is a PC CRT, and uh. I don't know, the, uh, the HD CRT we were using does have a pixel scaler in it, so uh, that was mostly there to transfer from the widescreen to fit the uh, fourth screen image in there. And this hasn't got any capabilities of that. Not looking great for Sheik so far. We get one more kill in, though. All right, well, Pi is Amazing seems to want me to uh, explain this. I don't know if that's actually uh, worth wasting people's time on stream. Hey, man, if you, if you have an explanation. If people want to hear about it. I don't know. I think I might have to play soon, though. We'll see. Well, I think we actually play, don't we? You want to be on the stream, don't you? <laughs> How many people we got here? Quite a bit. And we're confident swapping. Let's go. This is, this is legit. Are we playing? Check. Check Mike, check Mike. Sibilance, one, two, three. Is this, are you Jake? Yes, I am. Hey, nice to meet you. I spoke to you earlier. Yes, on Facebook, via Facebook. Yep. Noah, I hear that you're talking trash, man. Hey, where are you at? What's what's Noah's tag? Pi something. Oh, Pi is amazing. It's in between sets. No, I'm not. I'm not trying to sand, or I'm not trying to uh, sandbag at all. I feel like uh, it's like a half of a frame slower than uh, one of the other subs I was just pulling up on. But uh, regardless, I got used to it after the uh, second match. Nice, thank you. So it looks like we've got. Is it Mike versus Mike? Mike and Mike. Mike and Ike's. Mike and Ike's going on right now. Nice. Match is beginning. Got FD. Two here. Uh, we got GOM, Generations of Melee, uh, Echo versus Young uh, Mike. He's uh, the Peach player. Peach is up and coming, uh, or I mean, uh, Mike is up and coming. He's a uh, 64 player. Where is he out of? Uh, he's from Lincoln. Um, he's been getting better. Um, he did pretty good last tournament. We got like we got YL, Young Link only. Liking this young Link. Oh yeah, he's he's a player that's been uh, around of for quite some time. The few characters I'm familiar with, Link and Young Link would be the two. Oh really? So. So it looks 
Hopefully as of right now, Echo's really trying to feel out this Peach player. I feel like he's trying a little too hard in the fundamentals right, uh, right now. He's, his neutral game is, uh, he's taking a little too long to get in. He's, he should be more confident with his movement and his spacing. There we go. Now what do you think he should, he should be setting up here on Final Destiny? Um, honestly, he needs to get a bomb in his hand at all times, uh, so he can drop it. And notice that he grabs the turn up instead. Yeah. Um, very good decision. Um, Mike uh, decided to use a uh, down smash in that uh, situation. I feel like he should have stayed moving. Maybe uh, tried some floating techniques. Oh, what a recovery. Okay. They're still feeling each other out. They're not comfortable with one another. Um, Mike is trying to uh, camp as he's losing, and uh, Echo is just taking complete advantage of that. Yeah. What a combo. I did not know that combo. Down air, uh, down throw to uh, down air. That's pretty, that's pretty interesting. Uh, the bomb to down yeah. air. Yeah, it was, it was really that's, interesting. Uh, you can see a lot of that with um, Armada. Oh, yeah. He's a different caliber of player, yeah. though. <laughs> uh, that's what he brought out against Hungrybox. Oh, yeah. To counter his really buff. You know, Hungrybox uh, played really well, but... Evo? Oh, yeah. Very well. Get back to the match. Um, oh, Echo with a close recovery, but uh, he loses his first stock. Comfortable lead, though. Yes, very much so. There's no break. A lot of edge what guarding options downer. with Young Link. Oh my god. A lot yeah. of edge guarding. The zoning that uh, Young Link can uh, do is quite underrated. Uh, so many projectiles. Under oh yeah. Solid aerials. Grabbing the turnups constantly. I feel like Echo is kind of showing off his uh, tech skill at the moment right now. Oh, using good use of the up B on the ground. I haven't seen Mike uh, float to uh, Nair or any uh, advanced techniques quite yet with uh, Peach. And uh, Echo, Echo's, out of that up Echo's uh, showing off his swag right now. <laughs> taking a complete advantage of uh, Mike's lack of uh, the matchup. Echo used to make. Peach. is slowing down a little bit. Very much so. Alright, we got full screen right now. He's going in. Notice how Mike hasn't really been in control of the match at all this whole time. Uh, no, it's. He's really been uh, trying Link's to been stay in control of the stage. I think speed's a lot to do with that. Very much so. Young Link's movement uh, is actually very underrated, but that could be just because uh, not very many people actually play him. No! Very good very up fast. smash. That up smash actually beat the down air. That's kind of strange. Yeah, I'm not sure. Oh, he got stitch face. He had a little on that, but. Okay. That's the yeah. first float that I've seen. Right there, he's going for the up throw to the down air. Oh, yeah. Echo turtling a little bit, trying to get Mike to come in. Echo has it now. He's just, you know, taking advantage of his Yeah. Lead. He's trying to just, you know, he's playing it safe. Yes. Yeah. Oh, that was anything. a good recovery done by Mike. It's happened to all of us. We've been up a stock. I haven't. <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Very flashy. Very flashy. Showing off. Okay, let's see where they're going now. Uh, I'm guessing that they both agreed on this stage. Um, this is Did not a viable this. stage, no. actually. But hey, we're here to have fun. It's a free tournament. Yeah. What do you think has the advantage on the stage? Oh, uh, very much so, Peach. Um, because of the floating? The, the, the very small neutral game that's going on on the uh, basis of the stage. Um, her crouch cancel is quite amazing. Um, maybe the platforms would really do good use of Young Link's uh, projectiles and uh, gaining control if he, you know, takes control of the stage at one point. But I really feel Peach is just uh, a higher caliber character that she can easily take advantage of the stage. Mike really needs to start moving around a lot more. Um, Echo is basically just dancing around him at the moment. Echo's trying to show off a little bit his uh, his hook shot technique. <laughs> Playing Ocarina of Time. 
Oh, he misses that L cancel and gets punched from back here. Closer game this time. Oh man. The back air to neutral air was quite sexy in the corner right there. Alright, we got a Nair to afford uh four dash attack. Okay. Peach might take a lead here. Man. Like I was saying before, I really feel like Peach has the advantage on the stage. It's a pretty good counter pick, uh, especially since I got a lot of go here. Oh, he missed his down air opportunity because he blew up his oh, so going. bomb. Oh, what a combo. Nice. Card a down air. It was so close. Generations of He's melee. He's setting him up so well for those down airs. Oh, that's unfortunate. We've got a close match right now. Tight battle. It is a little more competitive than the last one. That could be the stage, though. Yes. See, as he, as he used that down smash. Yeah. Echo is a very aggressive player, and when he gets his confidence, he's willing to um, play very in your face. He's very good at it, um, but obviously all of our strengths can typically uh, be used as weaknesses. For the that was a very there. nice wave land off with uh, Young Link right there with uh, Echo's movement. Nice wow, combo. a reverse nice of B. Amazing. Nice Euro roll right there to stop <laughs> himself. This is still a close match, even it though is. Echo seems to be in control. Ooh, Echo's, Echo's trying to set up combos. He's feeling him now. This game is so good because of the DI. Especially so in these type of matchups where you have to really be experienced to know uh, what like a person's DI options are. Spirit, Play by Peach right there. Yeah, the forward arrows made it. Okay. Echo's taking the lead. One down smash could bring it all he's, back yeah, together, though. Looking, Link's looking for the knockout, though. Misses that up there. He could have finished the game, but uh, we'll see what happens. It looks uh -oh. like he's, he's going for the bomb combo. Okay. That was a good setup. Nice. Oh, wow. Notice how that arrow canceled his down smash and then he followed in with an air. That was a very good setup. He Echo. has very high priority aerials. He does, yeah. Link himself, I mean, yeah. the two characters, their their priority is uh, underrated. Solid areas. Who do we got next? Echo and Uli on screen. Echo and Uli. No, why are you not here? Why are you on the stream, but you're not here? John's. That's all I'm hearing. If, if, I, even, if I even have an excuse that I'm going to read here. Uli is good, though. Yo, where's Caleb Hart, man? Where's my buff gamers at? I'm right next to you. <laughs> How many setups do we have right now? Four? As of right now, we have four. Yeah. Round two, Falcon and Mark. <laughs> Okay. I haven't seen Echo's Falcon in quite some time. I'm not sure uh, how warmed up he is right now with Falcon. In 06 and 07, his Falcon was uh, high caliber. He actually did some pretty uh, good matches with Dark Rain. Okay. Eli taking stage control. He's got center stage. This is good. Never want to approach with Nair in this matchup as Mark. It's a it's a very terrible decision to make because uh, you can get scooped up by uh, over B. Um, he can get under you with up uh, up air. No, these are things you should be doing. Good edge guard by Echo. He's going full Falcon. Okay. 
Echo making good use of that down air through the platform. You can easily avoid that by just simply crouching. Um, you have to be paying attention when uh, your opponent's on the platform like that, especially with a Ganondorf or a Falcon. They will definitely try to uh, use that to their fullest advantage. Eli's doing good. He's staying neutral. Okay. Trade with a forward smash. Echo reading the dash dance. Nice grab. All right, follow up. Oh, he follows up with the up air. It should have been a fair. Oh, man. Good down air by Uli. Uli needs to avoid getting hit by this invincibility. Echo nice. with a good placement of down air to uh, D. Plays it safe. All it takes not is that one there's gift. anything wrong with that. Yeah, no, not at all. Notice how Echo waited for him on the platform. Eli doing a good job. He misses the edge guard, but he's still in stage control at the moment with the rolls that uh, Echo's deciding to use. All right, Eli still has stage control at the moment, but he needs to uh, he needs to get Falcon off the edge right now. One downer to knee could easily uh, end this in an edge guard. Good grab. Good follow up tech. Oh nice. my gosh, what an amazing decision. Just what he needed. Okay. Oh, and he gets the grab. Falls. Oh. This looks like it's over for Uli. Yep. Okay. All right, looks like uh, I got Sass Fowler joining me right now. What's up, dude? Oh, not much. How's it going? I'm chilling. You're still in uh, winners, or? Oh, yeah. There we go. Solid snake right there. Oh, yeah. It was, uh, Caleb Hart does not have bigger fucking pecs than me. That's impossible. I saw that, Noah. Don't. I will go shirtless. He definitely doesn't bitch as much as me. He's nowhere. I mean, he's my bro. I'm all about the buff uh, gamers, but come on, let's be real. He hasn't entered a competition. Looks like this is a match. Is it? Yeah, this is a match. Oh shit. Okay. This is second match. Echo's one up right now. Echo's switching characters. He should have stayed Young Link, man. Yeah, I thought he was Young Link only. Why alone? Dude, he's. No. He's not. He's not true. No. But hey, I mean, even though Echo's, you know, Young Link is very entertaining to watch sometimes. I'm glad that he's picking, uh, you know, the right characters. Okay. Uli's making a very. Oh. Uli, uh, a little overzealous right there at the moment. Uli using those nares. Doing a bunch of F smashes though. Seems like uh, Mike is catching on. Yes. Uh oh. I'm gonna follow up the edge guard. Dude, did you find your controller? Damn. Rest in peace. Good roll away. Echo didn't punish. I feel like he was waiting for the uh, get up attack. Mm. Nice approach with the, the reverse back air. approaches. Oh. Oh, and this. We'll see if he finishes. It. Oh, no. Oh. oh, I thought he was going down air. Good comeback for Uli. He definitely could have been taking advantage of it there. Oh, what a combo. What a good follow up. All right. Crisp. This is basically evensies. One grab. Oh, what a good power shield. It's like at the back of the shield. It's crazy. Yeah, that over the head shield. Uli with a good decision on his recovery. That was super low. Ooh, nice jab in there. Good stage awareness, definitely. Yeah, he knows the, the boundaries of this stage. Echo pretty familiar with uh, Marsk uh, grab frames and whatnot. He baited that uh, to a spot dodge and uh, followed up. He missed okay. that cancel. Got punished for it. Good nice soft back air to back air. Oh, you like it a little overzealous. Good games, good games. 2 0 by Echo.
Falcon Falco is looking pretty good right now. Who? Me and Jerry. All right. Well, All right. we're gonna go play. All right. JBM versus Status Fowler. Keep tuned. Uh, Luigi Ditto. Maybe. No. Yeah, that's pretty sweet. So we got JBM and Satisfiler next yes. on the stream. This is legit. Now you actually have a, a chat. Really? Yeah, dude. We can actually talk to these people. Greg uh, Dang. Who's all in here? Sucks at making me next to so We got Greg Dang. That's Houston. right. Why is Derek on the stream and not here? There's a lot of people that aren't here. It actually really sucks. I mean, considering that, how many people? Probably half the people here are from Lincoln. Yeah, I know, right? So I don't like know what happened to our crew. Kind of disrespectful for Omaha not to, uh, not show, to for show these, up for this friendly tournament. The pre, you know, like when I mean when we went down yeah. to Lincoln on Friday. I mean, there's what seven or eight of us, but the rest yeah. twenty, kind of like fifteen, like maybe. <laughs> yeah. No. So it's like. I do suck at X4, right? I don't play that game, not yet. X4? I'm trying to speedrun it. X4 is alright, I guess. I think when I was a kid, like, I didn't really like X4 because uh, of the ending. Like, oh, yeah, the, the ending was super wet. You beat the game with X? Like, yeah. I like the uh, I like the dialogue, I understand what X is saying, but I, the, whoever did the voice acting for X, <laughs> yeah, and the end of X4. Kid. It made me embarrassed to play the game. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. I was, I was only like nine or ten years old, and I was embarrassed. Yeah, that so game was like. So I was like, like, what happened at the end? This game was sweet. Yeah, so I was so I was a grown man. Oh, so okay. I was like, oh, anyway, oh, JBM. Uh, JBM sucks. Well, that's that's, <laughs> that's what happened. <laughs> what? Uh, let's see if we can get up here. Oh, oh no! We go to Battlefield. Folks. Gonna kill him with the up there. Up smash. Oh, okay. Damn. Yeah. Nasty tipper. Oh. oh no! He needed a roll, Jimmy was dead. Oh, damn, that was a crush. Crush not good for Jimmy. Maybe I'm just camping the edge. Ooh, that sound. I like it. <laughs> God. <laughs> this is just the most was... real setup. I gotta admit. Oh yeah, everything's crispy clean. So hopefully a lot of people show up for the tournament tomorrow, so we can I actually show I think there'll be a ton of people, off. I'm hoping. You guys oh. using this for the fighting games too? I believe we're gonna do that after, nice. yeah. Because Smash is like the first half, basically. The fighters will be on after. Oh, dude. He's right. There's an R missing on Satisfiler. There's an R missing on yeah. Satisfiler. Is Satisfiler too long? Well, uh, that's kind of inappropriate. He is jailbait right now. Not an M. Oh, JBM. JBM. Yeah, he's he's he kind is, of he, he looks like he's himself. looks like he's upset about that first that first death, yeah, you know. Absolutely. And so he's flipping. He's metaphorically flipping no. Tyler's couch right Spartan now. Army eighty four. Follow All right. <laughs> uh, shout outs to Spartan just Army 84, man. That is. Oh, it's not. Oh. Arguably the best part. What do you think? <laughs> I don't know. Yo, Falco is living the dream right now. 173, what do you think? What do you think the chances are of bringing this back? Uh, man, Mark sucks at that killing a high percent, dude. Yeah, and that's Falco very true. The higher percent Falco gets, the more likely it is Falco's going to win. Well, oh, that's, not uh, that's what I've heard. I can't be the case. Yeah, no. Um, I think JBM likes this matchup up uh, a lot. Yeah, Mar absolutely. Marth versus Falco. He plays against fucking David all the time. Um, you know what I found interesting though is like. When I used to play against uh, JBM's Marth a lot with Falco, yeah, uh, I felt like I, you get more results if you don't shine. 
Like, a lot of Falcons just shine out of panic, you know? Yeah. But, like, with uh, dealing with Mars range and everything, if you actually just shine less and just uh, go in down air, just jump out with a laser or anything. Yeah. yeah. I mean, I think that's that's the uh, like, most efficient way to play Falco against Mars. I mean, if you can get the shine, like, do it because you get pillar, I guess. But if you mess up, Mars will grab you and you'll die. And it's, it's cool. Oh, yeah. I mean, dying is cool. Yeah, that's <laughs> Absolutely. That, it's that's a bird. I can't stuff. really do anything. Kind of interesting that Tyler stayed Falcon here. Who does he usually play a lot? I see him mix it up with Luigi, Jigglypuff. I think tournament wise, he must play soft though. Mm. You gotta have the top tier. Ooh. Oh no. Oof. This is looking bad. Yep. yep. Oh. Solid. Well played. Ooh, no shine. Up smashing. Ooh. Oh, smash oh, moves oh, oh, are happening. Oh, no, never mind. I thought, it, thought something was oh. happening. I mean, how do you feel about Ooh. when you play Marth? You play a lot of Marth. How do you feel about this matchup? This matchup? I... Fuck. <laughs> oh, you just <laughs> fucked. No, uh, yeah, I understand. No, I, understand. I don't know. I think it's kind of tough. Because Falco immediately Oof. has control that of the matchup with lasers. But That's like my kind of DI. I DI like that all the time. <laughs> um, but if, he, if Marth gets a hit... Usually, most Marth players are able to capitalize and take yeah. the stock immediately. Because Falco can't do recovery his ass. Like, where would you, as a Marth player, not want to play against Falco? This stage. This stage? Yeah. Really? I was actually about to comment that I think this stage can be good for Marth. I think it's good in the neutral, like, really good for Marth in the neutral. But if it transforms to mm. this one of those stupid stages, yeah. you can just get screwed, like, just because of the stage. Because I just, I've always felt, you know, it's not like Falco's going to kill you up, you know? Yeah, absolutely. And so the ceiling doesn't really affect yeah. you, and the platforms are at perfect height. So. Exactly. For our tippers I mean, and everything. Um, but yeah, it was a good match. Yep. Solid. I think it's you versus Jerry, nerd. Me Unless he's doing losers. Um, yep. What are we doing? Oh, I have to play? All right. Here we go. I'm back. Let's Howdy. go. So back for more. Here comes Echo. <laughs> Echo versus JVM. Two T's for your name, sir. Yes, my name is Two T's in it. It's spelled correctly. It is not it. That has caused me problems in like every government institution where they screw it up. Goodbye, Pi. Who is Pi as a lady? This is amazing. Plan. Oh, that's Noah, isn't it? I like this uh, CPU mixing things up. It's gonna be fun. <laughs> yeah, leave the CPU. <laughs> Shoot lasers. Just gotta fight around the CPU. CPU wins. You just have to like go home. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna place my bets. I'm just gonna play on uh, Battlefield. Yeah, Battlefield sounds like a good bet. Oh, we no, the just randomizing. I like it. Oh, there, there we go. This checks are real. All right, this can't All be real. Right. We're going in. All right. I could be using PK. I think that's a good choice. Typically counters in Mark. I have nothing to say. This is just standard. Yeah, standard. Oh, dead. All right. Oh, Ooh, that was very nice. Oh no, what was that even? Oh no, that's Ooh. Not. A little more uh, looking pretty even. even so far. Let's see what JPM will do about that. He's gonna take center stage. Maintain the neutral with his big ass sword. Oh, that's gonna be it. It's always the skewer. Good decision. Echo is good, good. He's living. Echo seems pretty uh, in charge of the edge so far. Absolutely. Not a whole lot of crazy Marth combos going on yet. Oh, not at all. 
Oh, maybe yeah. Ooh, as long as he can stay out of the air, it seems like he's uh, going to do pretty well. I was just talking about Echo earlier. Being grounded as a Sheik is uh, pretty important. Yes, that is absolutely Especially true. against Marth. You can just wave dash out a shield, make him miss space, and just grab him all day. Yeah, Marth has a lot of nasty tricks he can do in the air. For sure. Oh, oh wow. Oh, very nice, goodness. very nice. ABM, what are you doing? Oh my goodness. Oh, wow. This is classic. Ooh, ooh. That's, uh, I guess you just, uh, Trying to even things out a little bit, you know. It's just a. Uh, <laughs> I'm gonna give you a slot. That's BM, you know. Oh no. Oh, it's okay. Sheik's got a lot of options. Absolutely. It's interesting watching all this after I was discussing, uh, you know, Sheik's strategy with him not long ago. With this matchup, you know, how about this matchup on streams so far, haven't we? Wait, what? We've had a lot of Sheiks and Marth so far. Oh yeah, that is the character. <laughs> oh. Yep. Platform Looking is tough. Is he going to bring good. us back? It's okay. He's back. Back, back to die. Back. Oh. Echo will go. He might switch characters, too. He likes to switch characters. Where are they going to play, though? That's... It's going to be Battlefield or FD or Random. I don't, see, I don't see either one of them actually pitching, pixing like, you know, Yoshi's story, for example. Yeah, I don't think he'd go Yoshi's. He could go... Aw, uh, he won't go. Nothing exciting. Oh, yeah. Put out, like, a pocket Kirby or something. I mean, well, I think he... Uh, mm -hmm. I think he might pick Peach, but... Uh, oh, like Jungle Japes, I like it. Jungle Japes, yes. I mean, <laughs> we just played on On It not long ago. <laughs> it's all good. Ooh. I haven't seen this box in a minute. Ooh. Should be interesting. You know, it's a, uh, oh, it's a good thing they were both on the same level. If they picked different controller ports, they'd be uh, starting out in a really bad spot for against the fox. <laughs> Let's escalate it quickly. Oh, yep, good way. <laughs> Denied. I'm end that real quick. We got DDR. Got one plug in the background. <laughs> Wrecked. Man. Maybe Fox was not a great choice. Wow, I'm hearing a lot of DDR. Hey, JBM, SD. He cannot recover anymore, guys. Just scare him up. up. Neither can Echo. This is not FD. This is the best winner's finals ever. Are they out of sync <laughs> with the game? I'll just kill him. Do they not know where they are? Oh, no. Ooh, don't sink. It's a good way, but you can really capitalize on that air spot dodge. Ooh. Can end it right there. Oh. Wow, he just grabs him out of his dash. Oh, that's pretty oh good. I thought he was gonna have it. Nice, Rap. nice. Good lunch wrap. Maybe we'll see a comeback from Echo here. Oh, goodness, DI! <laughs> it's okay, they'll, they'll probably both just kill each other. <laughs> or JP kill, kill themselves. SD again. Oh. Wow, oh. look at that. Oh my goodness. Almost, oh, right? Close. We were hoping. <laughs> Yo, spot Dodge City. Oh, oh he just threw an F smash! It's just three out of five. Winners finals. <laughs> it's already winners finals. Turbo. What are you standing up for? I wonder if he's gonna stick with Fox. I don't think that went quite as well. I think he should go back to Sheik. I don't up, know. If up until Sheik. like halfway through, I thought he really had that first match with Sheik there. Yeah, he did. I agree. He's pretty in charge. I think if he just uh, push really hard, he could have it happen. I don't. Michael plays in a range of characters. Putting on stage, he'll switch to someone. Dreamland. He goes Dreamland. I don't think he'd go Peach, but mm. I haven't seen him do that in a long time. No, Poke Floats. Big Blue. I like it. I like Big Blue. Falcon Dittos. <laughs> I really want them to pick a goofy stage. 
Jungle Japes. Jungle Japes, play space animals. Jungle space Japes. animals are so broken Let's go, there. Jungle Japes. <laughs> They're so broken there. Oh my god, I knew it! Uh. They're both going Falco and Jungle Japes. <laughs> yeah. Jungle Japes is so broken this for is a Falco, good time. it's retarded. No, no, it's perfect. This is the way the game was meant All to be played. Right, Sakurai. Alright, just everywhere, because you'll just grab the leg. I just got an email from Sakurai <laughs> saying this is the intended uh, Oh, you're done. Stage. It's over. Back it up. Oh! No. <laughs> oh, look at that. Look how cool this character is on this stage. It just over B. It's the most hype stage in the game. We have gone back to like 06. It's great. Try on the items. Bombs only. Maybe you have a Echo is in charge right now. I'm not sure I like the idea of banned stages. It's up to the, you know, maybe. Well, I guess just the term banned is, uh. I yeah. guess anyone, anyone can pick any stage, I guess. Yeah, technically, if, if anyone agrees to it. It's, it's more fun if it was more encouraged. You get kind of tired of, you know, Yoshi, Kirby, Battlefield, and FD. But they're the best stages ever, man. <laughs> I want to play on turd stages. Ice you gotta Mountain, convince let's go. them somehow. Oh, oh, look at the water, it doesn't give a fuck. Oh, swept away. Oh. Oh, good mate, but uh, oh. shine's too good. Pick me up and put me down. Let's go. I'm not seeing enough like lasers and Ford bees. Oh, the water put. Oh wow. Why they? There we work? go. Ooh, oh my god, on the platform action. These thin platforms allow a lot of stuff you can't normally do. You saw it here first, everybody. <laughs> Smacked. Too good. <laughs> it is deadly below the stage there. Oh, you can't do that. That is that is the wrong. One. Ooh. Oh, this is illegal, you know. You can't just do that. Look at that. Just so you know, those side platforms, uh, I didn't think about that as an interesting uh, recovery dynamic yeah, well, under the platform. Yeah, exactly. It's so great. If it wasn't for the water, this would be a pretty good stage, actually. Falcon and Fox are too good on this stage, though, which is why they're gone. <laughs> yeah. They have too many options on this stage. Ooh, get points for getting the fish in the water. Oh, look at that. Oh! Come oh on, red. my oh. god, that was, that was a good trade. It's okay, yeah. Do it's that good. All day. It's good. They're just staring at each other on the platforms. Keep it hype. Keep it real. Yo, Echo is going to get him with the stage. It's going to be great. Oh no, are you oh, serious? All right. <laughs> He's still water. winning. It's He's still fair. winning, but that doesn't really mean a whole lot in the stage, does it? No, not at all. He might. Oh! Back. Oh! He just spiked oh in my the god. Water. Come on! Oh. No! Oh, oh shit! Oh, <laughs> no. I had hope this for it. This stage him. is so good. This should be legal again. I think we should that only play. Best. We should have a tournament of only bad stages. Falco only. That was beautiful. Jungle Jinx. I like it. We need some more of that in our lives. Hello, senpais. Wow, Another a lot of people joining. Stream. Oh, everyone's senpai? Mm -hmm. Senpai. It's funny that uh, Resaybot knows before, like, whatever it is it's telling us. Yeah, for real. Get with it. Greg Dang, are you coming tomorrow? All right, I bet an FD. Pick FD? Yeah, I'm betting fifty on space FD. Animals. Fifty dollars when they pick FD. Fifty bucks? Yeah. Oh baby. Well we'll never know. That's <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Battlefield. Alright man, the fifty dollars is disappeared somewhere. Damn it. Well yep, it's it's donated to esports. <laughs> e <-sports. laughs> oh, harder on that, it's alright. Well, a lot of jumping and uh, some kicking. That is that is the matchup. Oh, good. Up. All right. Fox has hit Falco. That's good. Fox has hit Falco a little more. Looks like it's Falco's turn to hit back. Oh, Falco hit hard. Yeah, Greg, I don't know if anyone can house you tonight. Maybe Joe or Nick and Donald. I would ask them. Are you to... going with anyone? Like Endgamer? Joker and Blink? What? Sorry, I'm talking to Greg on the chat. Oh. He's thinking about coming from Des Moines tonight. Also, I work tomorrow at 8. 
fun. So I won't be here till like 12.30. Fight the man, don't go to work. Fight him. Jobs are for weeks. <laughs> anyway, back to the match. We uh, got uh, Okay, the, the match is that uh, Fox is hitting Taco and Taco is hitting Fox sometimes. Oh no, where's the edge? Uh, oh. Fireball, I don't know. Whatever. Sea Groove. Sea Groove? <laughs> He's using C-Room. Yeah, let's just talk about CVS2 instead. CVS2. I'm a roll cancel like everything. That's what a shine is, basically. Yeah, I really think all the uh, Samurai Showdown characters add a lot to the game. Because you don't Samurai usually Showdown. find them with uh, King I've, of Fighters characters. I've never seen them actually really been played. Except, uh, I forget her name, Little Samurai Girl. Nakaru? Probably. She sheaths her sword. She's got the bird. Is that, does she have the bird too? Oh, I forget. I don't know. They all got something. Yeah. Some sort of animal. That's what Falco is. Is that bird? Spirit animal. Ooh. Oh, you go. Ooh. We'll see a full parry. Oh, ooh, oh, that was a hard read, man. That's... Got punished so hard for that. Yeah, that edge, couldn't have expected anything else, though. Try hard, thank you. Yeah, we're, we're gonna drop frames because our internet is just, uh, okay. Yeah, internet isn't godlike. It is, like, good enough. It's working. You can see the game. Yeah, I mean, nothing super dumb has happened yet, as far as I know. You could broadcast in black and white. Get some more bandwidth. There we go. Oh! Smack. They were playing on the platforms. Huh? Now they're playing kind on the bottom scary. platform. Ooh, what? nice deflection. Ooh, I just snaggled him. No, I didn't know why. Well, looks like Satisfiler's been <coughs> satisfied. Hey. Alright, where's he gonna go? Stadium? Nay? Uh, I think, gotta play on, I think they gotta play on Mushroom Kingdom 2. I'm, I'm down with that. You guys gotta play on Mushroom Kingdom 2, or else you're screwing around. Close. Yep. One more to the right, one down. Mm. These space animals in our Pokemon. See, I wish more people would hold R when they join this stage, because you get way better music if you do it. Oh yeah, that's right. Yep. Get the battle music, yeah. not the weak title screen, whatever, who cares, yeah. go to sleep. This music is weak. Oh, I'll that pool. At least the stage has lyrics, though. You just say Pokemon over everything. Oh, I thought it would have punished no. that. It'd be good if they just swapped characters every now and then. <laughs> the same thing. Get up there, okay. Basically, just one's a bird. One's a not bird. Yeah, All right, well, drills I'm, are happening I'm glad that uh, we're being informed again that we're dropping frames, which we already have. Uh, 25,000 know. dropped frames. Holy cool story. Holy. Our net's not great. Did the deal with it. Oh, man. Stay in your cage. Oh, no, this is the dangerous spot. Get out of there. Oh. I like the danger cage. Playing the Peach, it's really cage. good. <laughs> I like that. Ooh. He just went straight on that. I tend to make a danger zone joke, but I'll forego it. Oh, we're back uh, in oh, there. Oh, we're back that, in there. Oh, get no, out of the cage of danger. Okay. Oh. Oh, oh. no. Oh. There we go. All right, keep going. Go nuts. Just don't go in there. Oh, oh. It's go collapsing. Nuts. Oh, the no. world we know collapsing around us. Oh. Smack. Damn that. That hit his face real hard. What the? What the? Whoa, that was that was pretty cool. I think. Empty jump up smash, man. Oh. Ooh. Oh, miss. Yo, he wanted that so bad. He got punished for his punish. Ooh. Wow. <laughs> Denied. 
Oh, up smash. How to shield, please. Oh, okay, oh. that works. Wrecked. Alright, Climber, let's come back. This is Loser's Finals, right? Uh, no, Loser's Semis. Oh, okay. I think I have to play someone and then... Whoever wins between me and whoever plays the winner of this, and then gotcha. they play. Let go. Yeah. Oh, thunder oh. combo. Oh no. Whoa. Oh, really? Come on, climber. You gonna bring it back? <laughs> Still got the tag from before. <laughs> Whoops. Oh. He is in control. He's gonna keep those two stocks to the end. It's basically just yep. one important hit. Here we go. All right. Well, this is getting a little more exciting. One one. Go back there. That is your home. <laughs> I knew oh, it. Oh, that's not Mushroom Kingdom 2. <laughs> they just won't, like, get with it. They should have, yeah, Mushroom Kingdom 2 would have been cool. I'm going to throw you into the bomb. <laughs> or, yeah. Yeah, if you grab Birdo's eggs, they're, they're really <laughs> yeah, bad yeah, yeah. to get hit back. <laughs> oh, stages is a blast. Although I'm shallow. I pick stages I like the music. <laughs> that's the only reason I pick stages. <laughs> yeah, it's a great stage. Ooh. That's why you got to play on the four side. <laughs> that stage is too damn big. Dude, everyone can, wave everyone can wave dash up there. That's true. We can wall jump everywhere, or at least scare some can. Or just wreck nesses between the buildings. <laughs> anyway, Fox is looking Fox pretty is damn in good. charge so far. Yeah, Looks like Climber control. might really oh, no. take back Ooh. control. Uh, up tilt. Oh, no, he's, he's, he's living. He's good. Oh, no. He smack, smack, punish. smack. Oh, gosh. Not like this. He is in control. He was just messing around that first round. All Ooh. right, stock. Well, he's stuck behind. You just need a combo him once and he dies. Oh. Well, you've read the strategy guide for playing against Falco. Is just don't get hit by Falco, and instead you hit Falco. Exactly. It's a better strategy. It's an than... optimal plan. Yep. Yeah. Right on game oh facts. Oh my goodness. Ooh. F smash. Oh no, please. Oh damn, F smash is everywhere. All right, he's back. Oh, nice. I thought that would have killed him the second time and he's just flown up and just <laughs> been okay. <laughs> he is a heavy bird. He's a space animal. How does he fly? Oh, well, he guess he, he doesn't, doesn't fly. He doesn't fly, man. That's the issue. He has sleeves over his wings. got to take that off. <laughs> how, you can, how can you fly otherwise? <laughs> That's Darwinism for you. <laughs> All right. But, uh, you know, this is looking like a pretty big lead right now. Back to standard Poco, man. <laughs> ooh, ooh, good tech. Oh, God. Ooh. It's okay, he still has an entire extra stock. He's got this. Hey. Or does oh, he? Oh, wow, really? Ooh. 0 to 43. Because now it's his uh, Sad's Father's turn, isn't it? Oh, gosh. Ooh, ooh. Oh, nice. I like that. Oh. Is he coming back? Oh, good read. Very oh, nice. Very good. Oh, oh my god. Three, oh, my four god. grabs. Oh, no, the little brother laser. What is that? <laughs> is, he, is he really going to take back those two stock? That'd be phenomenal. Cutie Patootie. That's Tyser. I see you. It's over. Oh. Oh. Wow. This, you know, it, it, might, it, might, it might really happen. Oh. I don't know why this game penalizes you for being off screen. Ooh, Very was, nice. That was good. Nothing's better than denying a side B. Oh no, that's over. Pack it up. Smacked. Alright, that was a pretty good match. That was good. A lot closer than some we've had. For sure. Okay, I'm back. Right. See ya. And I'm back. Oh, these are nice and warm. Thank you, Eli. Right. <laughs> <laughs> so uh, here we got a picture of us. It's pretty cool. Yeah. But, um, so yeah. what have we had going on on stream so far? I've been busy getting bobbed. Oh, uh, we've been playing Super Smash Brothers Melee. <laughs> uh, it's 
pretty cool. Yeah. We just had Silas Filer and uh, Brian Cly. And it was actually pretty close, but uh, yeah, Brian, I, Brian I, just took it at the end. I watched the end of that. That was pretty good. Yeah, Looks like we're now. swapping out. All right, see you later. See ya. <laughs> testing, testing, testing. Oh, we got a little button check going on right now. Feeling up the TV. Yeah, they're both trying to move that fast, but they can't even do that dash dance in the middle of the match, so it's, um, you know, uh, I don't know. I'm not sure why it's a movement check, but uh, we'll get it going. We got both uh, Generation of Melee. Uh, ge oh, Generation of Miracle. Sorry. I keep, I actually, I keep I saying I like Generation of Melee, man. I think I like Melee better. Um, yeah, Generation of Miracles, Echo, and JBM on the uh, commentating. Uh, Fought along with the uh, easy button. When you get four-stocked, it's a that was easy. Indeed. Is this for real right now? Yeah, we just we got this beginning right now. We got uh, Ulias Falcon versus uh, Cumby, a uh, new and upcoming Sheik. Yeah, Cumby has uh, definitely go uh, gotten better steadily. Yeah, I was going to say, his grab game is getting a lot better, so it'll be interesting to see how this goes because, you know, Sheik's grab game against Falcon's obviously superb. So. Yeah, it's very strong. Okay. So Ulias oh, got stage oh. control. All right. Got some poor DI on the, uh, the up throw to uh, up air to the knee. All right, come be using that platform, camping underneath. Chris drives you right now. First time I think I've seen you like bust out as Falcon today, too. On stream, yeah, definitely. You is a uh, pretty moody player. He uh, loves to pick in between uh, his mark and his Falcon. They're both pretty sound. Okay, there we go. Good solid edge guard. All right, back to the invincibility game right now. Damn. Solid knee that he lamped right there. Okay. Cumbie's lost that. control of the stage. Um, he needs to try and gain some stage control back. All right, he's got center stage right now. Good grab. How do you think this stage is for a matchup, Sheik versus Falcon? I don't, I don't know who to give it to. I almost kind of want to just give it to Sheik by default. But I think Falcon can be pretty good here. So Falcon's uh, ability to camp on the platforms is uh, amazing. Right? Also, um, Sheik's recovery for yes. um, that ledge, you know? Yes. It kind of limits the options. She uh, she can do a lot of gimmicks, though, on the uh, ledge here. Yeah. Um, Gumby hasn't taken advantage of him quite yet, but um, anyways. All right. We've got a neutral game going on. Feeling each other out, kind of. No one's wanting to approach. All right. Gumby bait with the back air. Strong game right now. Gumby with those grabs. So close. He's just not getting. Uh, he's not taking advantage of that range. <laughs> okay. Good power shield. I mean, it's just so key to uh, to edge guard Falcon successfully. I mean, every time you let him back on the stage, you might be sacrificing a saw. Yeah, most you know? definitely. One hit by Falcon. I mean, his bread and butters are you know they're kind of basic. They uh, they lead into everything. Okay. You like missing that grab, but he falls up with me. That's a good decision. Okay, Cumby trying to make no his composure, him. trying to figure out what you guys doing. Eli is very confident he's approaching now, not being very you know, safe. I've noticed that uh, doesn't hasn't really shielded very much this entire match. I mean, if you watch him, it almost is like he doesn't shield at all. Yeah. I, I mean, I feel as though shielding is uh, very, very good against a character like, or a uh, player like Eli, because Eli loves to approach. But Cumby um, hasn't obviously picked up on that quite yet. We'll see if uh, either this match. Oh, he's going to fall. No, he misses the knee of all up. I feel like Cumbie, he doesn't know what to follow up with. He's uh, having a hard time following up. Yeah, at this point, it kind of looks like he's just uh, kind of like lost it, you know? He's not yeah. not really feeling it right now. I think he's just oh. ready to give this one up to play the next match. Okay. So it's a new match. I mean, that first stock can uh, be very, very important depending on uh, how the player's playing. I, you know, it's gonna be interesting to see what uh, stage he goes to. Actually, counterpick. Like, where would you, if you were playing Sheik, where would you counterpick Falcon right now? 
Um, if I'm Sheik, I would probably counterpick to Yoshi's. I like Yoshi's and Founded Dreams, unless he banned Founded Dreams. Uh... The platform game is amazing. You... And the uh, the wave land on to uh, hold shield and grab weight as good attack is yep. very good as well. He's going to go back. Yeah, and FOD against Falcon is pretty good in general just because of the platforms cutting off his, his aerials. His neutral errors, his up errors. Okay, so we got Kumbi approaching a little bit more. Alright, Kumbi misses that grab. You like falling up with the uh, up air. They're both wanting to approach each other, if you notice. Yeah. No one's really baiting each other with the shield or uh, with dash dancing. Mm -hmm. Okay, we got a mistake by Kumbi. All right. A lot of dash attacks, but I think she should be grabbing a lot more. Yes. I mean, against Falcon, that's so vital. Okay. Cummy's, Cummy's got stage control right now. I feel like he just needs to calm down a little bit and he can uh, gain control of this match. These dash attacks that he's throwing, I feel like Eli is starting to uh, realize what he's doing, and yeah. um, he's going to take advantage of that. Yeah, he's going to start good getting punished pretty soon here. Although Sheik's dash attack is really good. It is yeah. very good. <laughs> In no fact, way. if you cancel it with grab, it's amazing. It's unreal how far she'll go. Okay. Another interesting thing about this match is that they, <laughs> they haven't really went off the stage at all, like to do any edge guarding. No. They're playing like really, really conservative, so they're staying on stage and everything. I feel like both players are not playing uh, particularly as confident as they might usually. Yeah. Okay. I feel as though Kumbi is slowly but surely uh, feeling more comfortable as he plays Uli. But um, he really needs to uh, gain this composure and uh, play his metagame. This matchup is uh, quite free on this stage, in my opinion. Okay. Uli with a good backer. That was a good decision. It's going to finish mm, the stock. That's tough. Okay. Uli with the lead. Kumbi needs to take control of the stage with some invincibility. All right. Uli goes to the ledge. There's the grab. Okay. Follow Follows up. The See, fair. there we go. There's a stop. That's what you got to do right there. That was a good play. All right. Especially at low percent. If you can just get some of those grabs going. Some good tag chases. Ooh, what a knee. Okay. You like with a technical error right there with that nair. Come be really wanting to approach. He wants to close that gap and he wants to hit Uli. Whoa. See, like right okay. there. That back air off the stage. Falcon, like, you gotta punish Falcon every time he goes out. Overextends. I mean, that's his. That's how you punish that's, Falcon. That's the only the weakness, stage. really. I mean, if you just let him run around throwing moves all day, he's. <laughs> he's a very <laughs> solid it. character. When Falcon gets off stage, it's, it's very easy to follow up with edge guarding, and. Um, I, feel, I feel as though uh, Kumi's not taking advantage of it completely. Kumi charging his needles. Oh. Okay. That's tough, right there. Oh, he's giving him the opportunity. There you go. Will we take it? Oh, oh no. Yeah. Okay, he still has stage control. Misses the L cancel right there and gets grabbed for it. Mm -hmm. Ooh, what's he going to do here? Come be with the go. good patience right there. That was a, that was a solid decision right mm -hmm. there. Okay. It's evens he's basically yeah, I mean, right at now. That, at that percent, it's almost better just to dash attack than grab anyway. I mean, yes. It's guaranteed, so. Okay, we got to grab. He's going to follow up with some uh, grabs and uh, some forward tilts. Goes for the F throw. Okay. Can't follow up with a tech chase on that uh, throw, but um, all right, back throw. throw. Oh, goes for the edge guard. Gain, gain some confidence right there. And that's uh, gonna that's be it, tough. unfortunately. Yeah, went for a ballsy play. Yes. Pretty good match, though. Yeah, they seem like they were. There's tomorrow. We we still have a tournament tomorrow, the actual real tournament. So um, we'll see see exactly what happens. That payback. Yes. Flipping and, couches. And it's it's for mean, money, yeah. People yeah. will get flipped tomorrow. We need to have like a couch in the background here and like just have it flipped upside down. Yeah. <laughs> Where's your icon that we created? We need to get that oh. on the uh, thing as a sponsor. Flip it. That dude wants to flip a couch. I can see it. Oh, yeah. I see it in your eyes. You want to flip a couch right now? There's one down there. Dude, why were you uh, more, more charged needles? Just be patient. Yeah, I know. Let him approach you. Yeah. He has, he has, the only thing he can trick you with is dash dancing and speed. You were playing pretty solid though. 
I was just too impatient. I, I even realized it because I, I was just dash dancing. Is this real game? This looks like it's the real deal. Okay, so we got Brian versus Uli. Brian's, uh, I believe, from uh, Lincoln. From Lincoln. Plays along with his fellow Lincoln. Uh, B, Noah. We got Cam. Ice Climbers representing Nebraska. Ooh, that's rough right there. Uli takes first stock. Uli's looking really comfortable with Falcon right now. Brian is a... Uh, he loves to play aggressive in it. His, his, uh, his uh, hand-eye coordination is pretty good. Um... I feel like a lot of Foxes and Falcos make this match a lot harder on themselves because they don't take advantage of their lasers. Mm -hmm. But um, it is 2014, and people are starting to know <laughs> and take advantage of that. So right. no, I played some friendlies with him earlier, and I agree. I mean, he. I mean, the, the thing is, is like we both play really aggressive. Like he was just kind of up in my face, I was up in his face. So it was, it was really fun, you know. I mean, that's that's the fun way to play. It is. But against a character like Falcon, you have to take advantage. Yeah, of his I mean, he'll beat you in that one-on-one -on -one fight right there. Yeah, it's very much so. Okay. Solid back airs right now. Oh, you like with the get up attack. Some, oh, some solid, solid point place knees right now. Okay. Brian takes you less for a stock. You know, I feel like, and myself included, uh, a lot of people don't know how to tech against Falcon. You get no. so scared about trying to like worry about his tech chases and stuff that you honestly just don't know what to do. Oh, you like kills himself right there. No, definitely. I mean, I think that's the hardest part, especially for a new player, because he seems so overwhelming. Like, you remember the first time you ever played against Dark? Even, like, eight years ago, you know? Yes. And it's like, even if Dark was screwing up and just, you know, maybe he was just sandbagging, who knows what he's doing, you are just scared shitless to play this dude, because you know he's just going to sit around flying around your shield, yes. you know? And so it's just really hard to think. He, like, he puts the pressure on you. Always. His reaction time, along with his fundamental play with spacing and everything, and uh, just positioning himself to follow up on text like Eli just did mm -hmm. um, is unreal. And when you play a top caliber Falcon, it feels as though they can simply react and they can cover every option with grabs. Oh, yeah. I mean, it just makes you feel like one mistake is going to lead to your death. And so it just kind of, it's nerve-wracking because you're going to feel like, you know, you can't make any mistakes, and then that's going to lead to you making mistakes. Eli playing very I solid I mean, yeah, right that's now. a very nice edge guard. Yeah, you can't let Falcon gain control, uh, gain control of the stage. As soon as he does that, it's, um, it's a pretty, pretty fair game. Um, it's that neutral game full screen where you have to really take advantage of him and make him feel like he has the shield. Yep. Once you put him in a shield, it's a pretty free game. Oh man, this is going to be a pretty, pretty close game, I imagine. Eli's confidence is through the roof right now. He's approaching. He doesn't feel like he needs yeah. a dash tech or a dash uh, dance camp at all with Falcon. Okay, so we got some dash dance camping at the moment. Brian really trying to feel him out. Like I said before, when you don't uh, take advantage of your lasers in this matchup, it sometimes can feel like Falcon takes advantage of the matchup, like he has control constantly. Yeah. He is the fastest character in the game based on movement. You know that with some very uh, solid spacing and follow-ups right now. Okay, Brian has control. Brian misses that grab. Oh. Uli with the down oh. smash read. Uli is reading books right now. He is a. Uh, yeah, catch He's reading Harry job. Potter. He's reading his favorite novel. <laughs> Dr. Seuss? No? No one reads Dr. Seuss? Oh, with the tech in place and down smash again. I feel like Uli's got a good read on Brian at the moment. Oh, oh man, wow. he goes for the forward smash. That's the, str <laughs> the strongest <laughs> reads. We got some Street Fighter 4 yeah. reads going on right now. Eli is really, really comfortable right now. I think he's he's really feeling this. Okay, Brian has control right now. He's going to take advantage of it. Brian really needs to get some grabs. This matchup is a lot about grabs on Fal uh, Fox's side as well. Fox's grab game is actually uh, very underrated. No yep. one seems to use Fox's grab because they're obsessed with his four or his uh, <laughs> short hop there. Yeah, well, no, I mean, it, it is, it's really, really good, especially if you're going to pick a stage like Pokemon Stadium, you better be trying to kill up. And so, I mean, the up throws are going to get you there, you know? I mean, against Falcon, it can be really difficult to just plant up smash. Yes. And so I think, you know, like you said, the grab to up air would be probably your best, your best bet right now, unless you're going to be able to shine him off. Okay. Evensies right now. 
you like coming in with those knees, he's fearless. Oh, oh my, my goodness. God. Eli's reads wow. right now are very, yeah, very good. He is. I feel like Eli's a very confidence-based player. If he gets his confidence rolling, he can play amazing. Yeah, he's he's definitely playing better with this Falcon than he was with Marth earlier. So. Oh, we got an even match right now. One shine. Mm -hmm. Wow. Cool. Look at how he's covering all those options. Forcing his reaction attack. time right now with those down throws is very good. Oh, lands that solid down air. Just gonna take. Okay, got some tech skill oh, going wow. on right now. If he can do it, Come on, let him out. Oh, oh wow. he's in oh. the. Brian in control right now. Brian has stage control. He has percent lead. Yeah, Eli's just he better off very waiting well for it. this match. Oh, he's going. Eli goes for it. Balls deep. He's going. Oh, oh doesn't get that backwards knee. Oh my god. Oh, get a grab. Oh. Oh. Oh, whoa, whoa. oh Dragon Ball Z. What? We're going to a third match. Oh my god. Now, where do you think Eli's going to counter pick? Uh, you know what? I kind of feel like FD. Unless it's banned. If it's banned, then uh, Dreamland. Dreamland can be in uh, Falcon's favor. And, uh, I mean, yeah, you're going to live. Can, it can be a terrible stage. Fox Falcon ain't going to. Well. Yeah, but Falcon's not going to kill you. Or Fox ain't going to kill you there. Yeah. And here we go, Dreamland. Okay, I feel oh, like Brian's wow. getting more comfortable in this matchup. Oh, oh, wow. Yeah, he, you he missing those knees. He's getting the reads. He's just hesitating a little bit. I'm very surprised that Uli's not playing Marth. Are you? I feel like uh, with the way that uh, Brian's playing, I feel like Uli could do quite well with Marth. Yeah. Um... I mean, I just, I'm watching you last Falcon right here, and I just, I mean. He's, he's playing very yeah, solid. Yeah, he just seems like that's the character he's feeling right now. Like sometimes you just, I mean, you got sometimes the feeling for a certain yeah. character, you know? Like, I mean, if you want to play that style, and you can tell the way he's just going oh, in hard, you man. know? Oh, man, those knees. He's going. His, his knee reads are just amazing. Replacement is it's very good. Okay. Wow. Oh, the go. reads. Oh, oh my geez. gosh. Yeah, he's getting them. Oh, oh man, the, the mind game's right now. Empty jump to grab. I think you like could have made it back right there. I didn't think he, he would have made it back yeah. with his empty. Okay. A little neutral game going on right now. No one's really wanting to commit right now it's and uh, get a solid just hit. Just real close. Both these characters can dominate each other so easy. Yes, one hit basically. One, one solid follow up with a neutral move and. Uh, you can be done. Too. I mean, you, the combos are unreal. This, this is two out right? of three, correct? Yes. This is final match. Oh, there it is. Okay. See, yeah, and I think that's why a lot of Falcon players like Dreamland. Is you're going to kill Fox the same here, yes. but Fox isn't going to kill Falcon the same here. You have to really go for those side edge guards, um, either with back air or the shines, the early shines, like oh, Brian display the first uh, first stock. You like misses oh, that dash dance in. Piece. Oh. oh, lots of patience on both sides. Yeah. I mean, it's, they're both moving around the stage really well right now. Uli with those. Oh, oh man, Uli is reading where he's gonna oh, place. I his thought knees. he was going for it again. Uli loves the knee. He has probably thrown the knee at least twenty <laughs> times this match. Let's <laughs> well, getting the job done. Yes. Yeah, so, I mean, why not? If you're hitting it, why quit it? Exactly. Wait a second. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, yeah, yeah. I agree. <laughs> I think about it for a second. I was like, yeah, yeah, I'm okay with that. Oh, what a good bait. Oh, Ooh, Brian's man, patience was over 9,000 right there. Man, this is oh, just, okay. this is real close. Brian, Brian a little overzealous with that full hop in air. I mean, okay. you know, even oh, just man. a one stock lead. And Isn't oh, enough sometimes. Brian misses the edge guard with a shine. Oh wow! Look at that grab. Good reads, mm. good patience. Oh wow! All right. Oh, oh the, the patience with that, just reading that spot dodge. Oh there it is again. man, you like playing yeah. very solid with these knees right now. I believe that was a uh, knee thirty-two. Yeah, knee um, city. 
We have Judge, we had Judge Dredd on the screen just then. Uh, right. He was uh, delivering the law. I'm BRB. I am the law. All right, we got Echo versus Uli right now. Losers finals. With my uh, co-commentator, Millhouse. What's up? What's going on? Not much. How about you? Oh, just just chilling, waiting, uh, waiting for grand finals right now. We're gonna All start some uh, PM here shortly. Also enjoying these infinite knees. Oh yeah. <laughs> Dude, this cam is so distracting. When I see myself, I just want to look at myself. <laughs> okay, here we go. Schism. Schism, you're coming tomorrow, right? Sky's in. Schism, respond. We got 11 people watching. We got. Greg Dang in the house. Greg Dang. What's going on, my Do man? Please play Ness. <laughs> Why not, Schism? Dude, you got a car? Dude, don't give me that. <laughs> Dude, you got a driver's license. You got a car. You can be here. Come with your bros. Hey, is uh, Iowa coming? Blank was mentioning that... Uh, him and uh, Christian might be coming. I don't know if they're uh, they're still planning on that or not. Have you heard? Yes, nice. Okay, we got first match right now. Marth versus Falco. Starting it off on Fountain. I believe these two played earlier in the uh, bracket and winners, right? That I'm not sure of. Okay. Zulai's on a roll right now. He just played uh, two matches in a row, so maybe he's got that uh, yeah, that uh, fire just burning right now. Interesting he chose to uh, switch off Falcon with kind of the... Seemed to have a flow going with him, but yeah, maybe he's just not comfortable with that matchup, and I certainly wouldn't blame him. Yeah, Echo is very, very good at uh, playing the Falcon matchup. Um, some of the uh, players he played constantly back in the day were uh, Falcon mains, and um, he played Dark Rain quite a bit back in the day. Oh, wow. Yeah, that would probably give you some pretty good experience with the matchup. Yes. Nice uh, standing laser with F smash. Oh, man. The follow back tipper was amazing. Okay. This uh, this stage can go either way, in my opinion. Yeah. Oh, man. The no tech read, Johnny. Oh, man. Echo with that stone face killer. That was an unfortunate shield poke for Uli. Uli's neutral game is uh, non existent at the moment. <laughs> Echo is in his face right now. Echo's a very sound, aggressive player. Yeah, and it's very tough to have a good neutral game against an aggressive Falco. I feel like that's something you really gotta, you know, dedicate time to learning. Yes, you have to learn bad habits, you have to learn patterns. People who like to play aggressive definitely like to do uh, similar things. To uh, be very creative constantly is uh, well, and difficult. The, and those lasers are just so powerful in terms of stage control. Like, you really have to be able to work around those. Yeah, I see one laser followed up with that whole combo. Yeah. All right, so that's first match. This is a uh, three to five. We're, uh, we're just getting into it. You like can definitely make a comeback from this. There's no bans, so... Uh, I'm kind of interested. I think we might be going to FD. FD. But um, if uh, he goes to FD, I'm not sure who Echo will go. Echo has a large yeah. variety of characters he likes to play. So. Yeah, I know FD is kind of the uh, kind of the favorite stage for Marth in this matchup. I've always felt like it's probably a little more a little more balanced than in the Marth Fox matchup. Like I said, just because of those lasers. Yes. Marth has nowhere to run to in that in that sense. I mean, the only person that's really shown that that's, uh, that, that matchup is in Falco's favor is uh, obviously PP and uh, Music King at high level. But um, yeah, PP does amazing with his mark. Uh, Greg, I'll be here until PM's over. I, uh, I have to get back to my house and stuff like that. I got to hear my grandma in the morning before the tournament. <laughs> what time are you guys going to be here? 
So Uli decides to feel his Falcon. See he's got the Burning Desire inside. Yeah. Very solid full hop there right there. Okay. He's got the nice big stage for it too. Got room to breathe. With the way that Uli likes to play aggressive, I feel that Falcon is more suited for him because Falcon really, I mean, he can't camp against um, a character like Falco, Fox. The oh, 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 oh my goodness. goodness! Very, very <laughs> solid <laughs> People's right elbow. Now. Okay. Echo, Echo's, right. Echo's trying to feel him out. He's trying to, you know, play that patience game right now. He doesn't want to fall for something like that again. And really, generally, he's being putting very good pressure on you, Eli. Like I mentioned earlier, uh, Falcon's the fastest uh, paced character in this game, so when he starts getting fire burning inside, it's really hard to uh, gain that neutral game back, especially when you have an aggressive Falcon on you. Certainly, yeah. Okay. Ooh, oh, Ooh. get some technical errors right there. Uli going for kind of a lot of unsafe aerials, just kind of throwing the knees out there. Yes, yeah, so Uli is uh, all about the strong reads. Okay. Echo's not falling off with these lasers, so it's given uh, Uli the chance to uh, kind of gain his momentum and try and gain control of stage. Cool. Huh? We might be having a crew battle. Crew battle hype? Oh, oh, tries man. to go for the style. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Uli's like on stage it. right now. Let's see if I'll... Oh, okay. Echo doesn't fall with the edge guard right there, but he gets... Oh, man. Is that oh. it? Oh. Right. Falco's Firebird's too good. I like that trade from Uli, though. It was. So I'm going to take you with me. Oh, goodness. You lie expecting Echo to split, stay in right there. Okay. That's game two. It's 2-0 right now. Generation of Miracles, Echo. All right, so you like getting some motivation here. Uh, Greg, yeah, I, if we do cruise, I mean, we'll probably be here till I'm saying probably... 11, 30, or 12 at least, so I'll probably see you, man, if you're going to be here by then. Do you mean Chris as in Chris, or Chris as in Christian? Baby Ryokar. I'm hearing shouts of Forside. No bands. Three out of five. <laughs> oh, here we go. Oh, man. Jung Link. Echo also plays Toon Link in uh, PM, if you guys didn't know. Yeah. Got a lot of Hyrule hype going on right now. I love watching Echo's Young Link. Yes, it's... He's, he's very creative. Yeah. Notice why he's an aggressive player. He's very good at uh, coming up with new, different uh, approaches. Um, he doesn't look like if you watch like Armada or Lijin or any of them play Young Link, they, they utilize his projectiles a lot more and are much campier, but Echo's follow-ups, once he does get a hit with Young Link, are just incredible. Yes. Nice good tech. tech. All right. Solid F tilt right there. That might be the end for oh, oh. Uli with the overzealous, overzealous edge guard right there. Okay. I'm feeling the people's elbow would work in the situation right now. Echo trying to gain that stage control right now. Just kind of trade back and forth. Okay. Uli has stage control right now. There we go. Echo misses his recovery. Uli misses that grab follow up right there. Echo really looking for that rolling grab. Okay. Once Seafowl gets in the uh, gets in that UR combo, it's such a pain for him to get out. Yes. Very solid Nair edge card right yeah. there. 
the boomerang at low percents, it's it's just crazy that it does right around 16 to 18 percent. Yeah, and it solid. it pops them up so nicely, especially when a lot of like young links combos utilize kind of the upward movement. That boomerang popping up is a real nice tool. Yes, for follow ups, most definitely. Okay, Echo in control right now. Very solid effort in there. Whoa! You always have a hard time. Oh, man. Yeah, there it is. The Trixies and the flashiness right now. <laughs> nice bomb drop. Echo's creativity right now is through the roof. He's got stage control. If you notice, he keeps trying to go to those uh, first platforms and wave land into uh, gaining stage control against yeah. Uli constantly is matching. Uli hasn't been uh, taking advantage of that. Okay. All right, good edge guard. If you can take Young Link's second jump, it's very hard for him to get back. Yes. Notice how Young Link is not wearing iron boots like uh, Adult Link does in this game. Uh, yeah. His recovery is much better than Adult Link. Oh, okay. Notice how Echo threw that boomerang up. He really expected Yuli to follow up with a short hop approach, and he didn't. Ooh, oh, goodness. Man. Echo going for Flash. You like could definitely take this match right now. We'll see what happens. He definitely could. Oh, man. Oh. That'll be the end of it. it Commentator's curse okay. there. <laughs> All right, guys. Uh, stay tuned. I'll be playing Grand Finals against Echo. Okay. We'll look forward to it. Uh, someone hop in. Mafia, you want to hop in? I am over here. Oh, don't do that again. Right. <laughs> Jurassic Park yeah. going on. <laughs> well, it's time for more gaming. Uh, all right, so we got winners finals. Up next is going to be JBM and Echo. Hope they play on one of the best stages, like Mushroom Kingdom 2. I've been bouncing <laughs> that one all night. I hope someone does it. I've never seen that stage on stream. Tell you what, Moffat, if, if I if I get on stream during PM, I'll play a janky stage just for That's you. That's good. It's got to be four side. That's the one. It, it might have to be the pirate ship. Uh, I love the pirate ship. I mean, it's okay to be wrong. <laughs> <you know. laughs> That's what it's, they always say. It's just such a pretty stage. Pretty bad. It's got, got the Wind Waker graphics. Uh huh. Flies through the air. There's a boss battle. That's true. It's good to have bosses in the middle of your tournament matches. Yeah. Just in case. Shout outs to Smash 4. Yep. We had a game going on? Uh, I think they're just checking. Just checking what's up. Got that uh, glazed look in Young Link's eye. <laughs> it's just like, I don't care. He's had too much milk tonight. I've seen too much. <laughs> All right. <laughs> so notice Young Link. Young Link has the Kokiri shield. Okay. Oh, well, I think we're going into this. I played a Zelda game once. <laughs> My point was, he has the Kokiri shield like... Uh, Ocarina of Time Young Link, but he has fire arrows, like Majora's Mask Young Link. Oh, okay. Where in the lore is he? We don't know. All right, see, we got L's, we got the word lore, my brain just shuts down. <laughs> oh. I, I'm, I'm with Conan on this one. That's all right, we should probably actually, like, commentate the game. I, I thought this was a button check, but... <laughs> nope, they're going into it, it looks like. Oh, that was a, uh, a risky year, good nice. use of the... He's playing as Wario here, numbers. that's cool. <laughs> That's Wario right there. Just lost some weight. Uh, nice bear from Mario. Oh, Randall with his trolls. Good. Uh, right. Good prediction <laughs> there. <laughs> All right. I think he was just keeping track of where Randall was. How did Cloud get to be called Randall? Uh, if I remember right, he had kind of a few names in the competitive community, and then some smasher just start calling him Randall, and okay. it stuck. That's fine. But he, the Cloud doesn't have any like official name uh, in Nintendo canon or anything. It's definitely a Smash community name. Randall. All right, going for some hard reads there. I like that follow up on the down throw. Ooh, nice. Oh, very good use of the oh, fireball. The shy guys killed him. Yep. It was the shy guys. Or fly guys, I guess. 
I love the redirection of the bomb. We're gonna have to count the SDs after this match. Lots of SDs. Yep. <laughs> nice, Randall. Right, nice bear. Uh, <laughs> yep, the uh, the lower blast zone is so high up yeah. on Yoshi's story that... You, you should have been safe, by the Even way. when you tether, sometimes it's not enough. Yep. You should have counted the SDs. I just totally forgot. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, Ooh, got some bad. violence back there. Eli making noise! Yeah, you scraped that table. That's a good time. <laughs> yeah. If you guys play on Pokemon, hold R. It sounds better. I'm serious, though. I want to play. Yes. Yes, that is the correct stage. Termina? Yes. Mm, Have here a good we go. Time. Oh, shitty stage hype. I'm loving this. Home stage advantage for Young Let's Link, go. maybe. <laughs> It'd be great if the game actually worked that way. <laughs> right. uh, yeah. Little known fact, bonus points for whoever kills Tingle's yeah, balloon first. Have, actually, whoever kills Tingle's balloon the most times. Yeah. Uh, it actually gives you um, 100 free wins if you do it correctly. I read that in Game Facts <laughs> after I edited Game Facts. Yeah. Get those uh, those Prima strategy Ooh, guys. Very nice, nice F smash. I like uh, as Peach chilling underneath the platform there. It's a really rude thing to do. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Really good competitive play here. This is uh, <laughs> hey, standard that, standard stuff. They're having fun. I'm loving it. This is Evo. <laughs> this is Evo. We esports guys. We sports. Ooh. I uh, he's I in the a, he's in the water. I have a copy of you. We sports. I played Mario Sunshine. He can swim. You know everyone's ignoring uh, Tinkle up there. Yeah, no one's getting the Tingle bonus. Yeah, if points. you let him charge, he'll uh, you know he'll get vicious. <laughs> right. So I'm fairly sure Mario's back throw is a stage spike uh, in that spot, uh, really? similar to Mewtwo's. Uh, not that you could you couldn't tech it, but sometimes it'll catch a player off guard. Ooh, it's not good to be caught between the turtle and the platform. No. I'm sure, the uh, turtle has nice some Zelda combo. name, and I don't know. I don't if know Tingle doesn't Zelda. get killed once, I'm going to be very disappointed. If Tingle with these doesn't two. get killed, the tournament's over. and We're going home. <laughs> I don't know how it's not like first instinct to kill Tangle, so. I don't know. Ooh. Nice angled F smash. Come on, he's so open, that balloon. He's just like, hit me. Please hit me. <laughs> Get ready for Tangle hype. Tingle oh, has, very Tingle nice. has to go. Ah. Stage spike with it's the It's so dash hard to pack. see where you are under that water. Ooh, very good shield gonna... pressure from Echo, and it's, I gotta say, it's very hard to get shield pressure with a uh, young leg. Oh! Very nice. JVM loving these angled F smashes, and who oh, would... Oh, yes! There you go! Bonus Tingle points! Hype. <laughs> Tingle hype! Oh, oh, I wanted, I wanted to see that. Oh my goodness. So intense under here. Oh, the here. ceiling is really helping. You know what's also great is if someone's on top of the platform, you can totally just hit him through. Oh, oh my goodness, is he living? Nope. I think the turtle's OP. That was a very good F smash from JBM. The range on Mario's F smash is just ridiculous. He gets his arm, and then he gets like this explosion hitbox. Yeah. It's thousand, definitely not what you expect when you see the animation. Thousand bonus points to JBM for popping the tingle balloon. Yeah. Where will they play next? I don't know. I hope. I uh, hope Foreside. I hope it's not Battlefield. Go to Foreside. Foreside or uh, Big Blue. Foreside. Oh my God. I'm cheating. I'm looking at the real TV. I really want to see what they pick. It's like you're living in the future. 2.0, right? Ooh. <laughs> I think they're going for stage advantage with Samus. Yes! <laughs> All right, here we go. <laughs> Planet Zabes. All right, first one to break the platform with the bonus. Or the old side the gross things. God, this stage is just gross. Yeah, Those there's organic there's stuff breaking. 
really nothing I like about this stage. It's not as bad as the one in uh, 64. That's the worst Zeebs. Yeah. Well, let's see, and then there's the there, there's the other Metroid stage. The one where it rotates? That rotates. Yeah, that forget one's about even it. worse. The fun thing about this stage, though, is, of course, sometimes you can't die off of the bottom because of the yeah. lava. It facilitates dying off the top. <laughs> yes, yes, it does. Oh. Nice read, but it was wrong. Everyone uh, getting juggled by the lava. Ooh. If you get hit into the lava, into the, uh, I think it's acid or whatever, but uh, if you get hit into it, is it, does it become an SD? Or do you still get the kill? I think if you get hit into it, it's a kill. Okay. Doesn't count uh, as. But if you just jump sick. off stage into it. Yeah, it's that's an definitely SD. an SD. Or an LD lava death, I don't know. Yeah, usually you have to, uh, you, your, your feet have to be back on stage for it to uh -huh. be considered an SD. So even if you, uh, like, say, grab ledge oh. after being knocked off, yes. then SD. Platform it, wrecked. It'll count as a kill. If they can break both platforms at the same time, I I will give them money. Uh, Esports money, as we discussed earlier. Wants some grab action. So smack. The raw F smash paying off. Both players were getting a little cozy, kind of uh, just chilling. chilling each other out there. JBM took advantage. I like it. Ooh, break it. I'm totally watching this match, right? I just want to see the platforms get broken. <laughs> That's the real reason the stage is banned. It's too much fun to watch the platforms. Yes! He knows what I like. Platform breaks and grabs. This is like my match. The only thing I know about this stage in terms of balance is that it, it boosts... Uh, Ness's ability to win because he can yo-yo glitch off of the destructible parts. Uh, which should show you how much this stage is played. <laughs> because who cares? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's an S. I don't even know why you buy the bomb. <laughs> <Just lava jump. laughs> I'm loving these capes right now. Lava strat. It'd be nice to see like Mario just grab and hold Samus while the uh, lava comes up. Samus coming up through the bottom of the stage. Ooh. Oh! oh! <laughs> that was good. I like the spike back into the lava. It's like, don't get out of there. Get back in. Very nice cape there on the recovery. I also like seeing Kirby rock drop through it. Just like chill underneath. Survival respect, and we're done. Jeej. And zero, right, zero. We're, we're even. This is still anybody's game. Let's go. I, for one, hope we get an Echo win just so we can play more silly stage Yeah, matches. absolutely. It really brings the tournament alive. Oh, yeah. Oh, Very I wanted nice that lava to come up so bad during that. All right, it's good priorities. <laughs> it's worth it, though, <laughs> isn't it? For breaking the platform. Snare. Uh, Echo tries to follow up off the uh, little pop up from the lava. I would there. get away from there. <laughs> Both nice. players very high percent. If an Oz was them, I would get out of it. Alright, there uh, we go. Or Goofy Sage. Here we go. Mushroom Kingdom 2. I'd be really sad if they go back to like Battlefield or I'm something. I'm still holding out for Farside. I want to <laughs> see some. I want to see some UFO shenanigans. This is fantastic. Mute City is good too. I can, I can dig on Mute City. This is my favorite tournament so far, just because of the stages. Uh, Uli choosing the. No, oh. I'm sorry, not Uli. Uh, Echo choosing to go for the uh, C Falc. I see. I'm seeing a big stage advantage thing here. It's good to have those extra stat boons, you know. So it's actually good that he did the cape flip, giving that back. Back air is very helpful. 
Yeah, definitely. Alright, very Denied. nice, you are edge guard. The the blast zones on the sides are so close on parts of this stage. Yeah. Alright, JBM hoping for the uh hoping for the fast fall throwing those up Ooh. tilts. Very nice. Oh! Echo going for the Falcon Punch, loving the style. It's a noble effort. Would do anything else. Good solid guard. He actually wow. might have saved Echo there. Alright, throwing out the taunts. Very good. Good job, JBM. The stage might just stop in time. <laughs> oh, the pivot dance! <laughs> he just will not die. Finally. There we go. Pivot dance is S rank style, man. How'd you get to be so S rank? It is some next level mind games. 2.0. Alright, I think that's definitely the achievement for this round is the Falcon. Punch. He just wants the punch. Well, and Mario's been getting all of these sick fire punches. He wants a fiery punch of his own. You know, there has not been a single F Zero game in which Falcon has done any of his moves. He was created for this game. <laughs> and aren't we glad? Is F Zero X? Did that come after 64? Smash 64? I'm not sure. I'm actually not uh, like too familiar with the F Zero series. I don't remember even playing the original Super NES one. If I ever saw Falcon, granted, I didn't play a whole lot of it, but like I do know you see Falcon, but it's kind of like he's just some dude. Yeah, he just kind of shows up in the end credits or whatever. There actually is that there. There's an F Zero anime. Oh, yeah, he did do one <laughs> awesome Falcon punch. I, I had seen that. <laughs> In which Falcon does have all of these uh, sick moves. He only did the punch once, though. It was, like, really extreme. He jumped out yes. of the car. It took, like, ten seconds. Falcon punch! Really uh, tough for Falcon, considering the this floating platform here doesn't have a ledge to grab on. Really? I think it does. I'm pretty, I'm pretty I thought we'd seen some of that. I don't think I've well, seen him we'll never know. Yeah, we'll never know. We'll never know. We got the Falcon Punch. No one's ever playing this stage <laughs> ever again in the history of time. I don't even know why they programmed half the stage. All right, so we have another game. All right. Here's what is hoping, the goofy stage? I think, they, I think they've, for four they're side. laughing. I think they've already agreed. I'm hoping for four side or I think I think it has to be four side or Mushroom Kingdom too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's not the correct stage. Well, I guess we'll find out, won't we? Thank you for that. We're finding out now, aren't we? Oh, we're going. We're going with the salty runbacks. <laughs> I want to see seven minutes of solid dash dancing and then just really quick fight. <laughs> I love Falcon Dittos. Maybe more than any other Ditto. The Sheik Ditto's good. It's got a whole lot of twos. More knees, more Did you get that boots. special melee where you can only use the A button? Oh, goodness. It's just knees and knees only. Can't even use uh, the jump buttons. Did the discount store just knees? Was that a moonwalk? Oh. My god. I'm sure. Yeah. It must be. Talking with... Uh, with Brian, I don't know if he's a bee climber or a cardinal fan now, but Brian, whatever. Uh, that might be the same as the service of the UFO on four side and the uh, uh, the ice icy, yeah. on ice climber stage. In other words, icy. Either way, that moonwalk was sick. <laughs> so sassy. <laughs> oh, these knees. Good denial. Oh, the Raptor boost and the knee combo. I love it. Uh, going for the reverse. You're right. There's no ledge. Still gets the soft knee. 
Alright, goes for the hard read on that attack. Not a whole lot of punish there, though. Ooh. Solid bear. Echo definitely looking real comfortable with this character. Yeah. Pretty close match, though. Definitely. Not quite what I expected. 